In agricultural farming, we often use probiotics. Do you know which form of probiotics is better for agriculture, powder or liquid? Let me analyze it for you today. The probiotics in liquid form are really active bacteria. That is, you can use them directly after opening the package. The advantage is that it is easy to use. You can splash in the water or mix with the feed directly. The disadvantage is that it cannot be stored for a long time, usually only a few months. Even within the shelf life, may be affected by the storage environment and improper handling during the transportation, which will reduce the content of fireball bacteria and affect the use effect. In addition, if you are managing a large-scale farm, the amount of such bacteria used is usually very large, which will also increase the costs. The probiotics in powder form is a kind of inactivity bacteria. That is to say, the bacteria are in a dormant state and can only be activated when they meet certain conditions. So this kind of bacteria must be activated and tested before use. Moreover, because the overall price of this type of bacteria is relatively low and the purity of the bacteria is relatively high, it's suitable for the experienced farmer to use. At the same time, because the bacteria are relatively pure, after expansion, the effect is better and the cost can be reduced. My personal suggestion is that if your farming area is relatively large, you can produce some beneficial bacteria in your shrimp pond by yourself. And after all, the cost is not high and the effect is very good. The boss with a relatively small farming area can directly buy the popular brand probiotics. It's more convenient and will not cost waste. Are you clear whether the probiotics should be powder or liquid now?